Okay, this is basically take two <laughs> of my testing of the rig I've built to record Pokemon Go gameplay out in the world and do sort of a Let's Play style thing. Previous test, I went for about four minutes and the way I hooked up a microphone didn't actually work for the GoPro, so now I'm using the internal GoPro mic, which should be alright just for this test, just for a proof of concept, I'll have to rig up a separate mic I think to do it. I was, I was using a splitter to come off my headset mic and apparently GoPro doesn't like that. But as you can see, we are just near the Botanical Gardens actually in Sydney if you're not familiar with the area. I've come up on my first gym um, and it's an enemy gym. This is actually my first gym battle. So we're going to jump straight into the deep end here. I, I did an intro when I was talking about Pokemon spots and I caught a, I caught a nice little strong caterpie and a strong caterpie. But yeah, none of the audio worked so <laughs> I can show you if you like, but it's just me going. Anyway, first gym battle. Let's see what this is all about. I've never actually done this before. Excited to try. Okay, Volunteers Memorial Gym Level. That's a very strong, strong dojo. <laughs> I don't think I can beat that. Who else is here? It's a very strong Pidgeot. I don't think I can beat this gym. Those guys are very, very, very high level. And I haven't leveled up much at all. But let's give it a go. Let's see how we fare. Um, yeah, see, look, my highest level is 228, so we'll, we'll do the Clefairy. Uh, oh, wait, we select here? Okay. Uh, do we organize by HP, I think? Clefairy. Wait, do my... How am I selecting this? I'll turn the AR on anyway. Ah, screw it, we'll just go. Rip. There we go, there's my little Clefairy. There's the Dodrio. So... Tap to attack. Not very quickly. I'm doing alright. I'm actually doing alright. Oh, 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 can I dive? I feel like there's not enough room on the screen. It's, it's very claustrophobic. So I'm tapping to attack. Swiping. Swiping. Tap. Tap. Swipe. Tap. Swipe out of the way. Nope. Uh, and he's dead. Tap that. Tap and hold. Nope. Can't use that good at me. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Nope. Nearly got him. Nearly got him. Go, Kafari. Finish him off. I'm no good at this. Go down. Die. Okay, I don't know how to do this. It's not working. Come on, Pidgeo. Pidgeo's down. Go, Goldie. Why won't this Dodrio die? Oh, Caterpie. <laughs> what the hell? Not working. Why is it wasn't a Dodrio doing anything? Let's back away at it. Zero. Countdown's ended. Did I win? Time's up. Uh, Pokemon defeated zero. XP zero. Gym prestige zero. Okay, well that sucked. Didn't do very well there. Let's move on. <laughs> I knew that gym was too, too high level for me. Uh, but now I've got a bunch of fainted Pokemon, so I guess into items. And right, there we go. Revive Clefairy, Revive Golbat, there we go, thank you, Revive Clefairy, thank you, Goldeen, Revive, might as well, come on, man this interface is slow, come on Pidgeot, Revive, Revive, there we go, thank you, come back out, give these guys some potions, no, don't discard potions, give Pidgeot a potion, there we are, give Golbat a potion, there we are, Fairy potion, there we are, Right, so, first gym battle, learned some harsh lessons about trying to figure out the paddle system for a start, so I was just kind of randomly tapping and swiping, it didn't seem to do much, <laughs> either way, so I've got to, I think I've got to figure that out properly, but uh, yeah, that was, that was far too high level, hopefully, one of these other gyms around here are uh, a little bit lower level, I don't hold any hopes though, I reckon, I suspect, the same person is going around to claim these. 
There's another red gym down there and a yellow gym. Team, uh, team Valor and Team Instinct, red and yellow. There's on Team Blue, Team Mystic. Hello. Come here, little gobbit. Not gobbit, Zubat. Uh, Too much. Oh no, nailed it. Come on, you little fucker. Man, it's a low res camera shot right there. <laughs> hey. Alright, what'd we get? Got it. Uh, CP44. Actually, we might just transfer him straight away. Ba doop ba doop. Alright, moving on. So, yeah, this is actually the first time I've ever uh, been out in the world with Pokemon Go. It's nice. And it turns out one of my common. Ooh, Electabuzz! I want one of him. One of my favorites. Let's uh, try and arrange the camera so he looks like he's standing on the fence post. I don't know. <laughs> I normally don't play with the uh, normally don't play with the AR function on because I've been playing in my home <laughs> where it doesn't look as cool. Come on, come on, come on. Hey, I'd like to buy this added to the collection. Hopefully, he's a bit tough. Let's have a look at him. Blah 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 blah. Uh, CP-137, not too bad. What has he got? Got Thunderbolt and Thundershock. Alright. Ooh, there's a Krabby. Now we're talking. Bob, 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 bob. Uh, yup. Nope. Oh. <laughs> I got confused by the AR camera. It looked like it bounced off the fence. Obviously that can't happen because I think it's a no, it's a fence. Yeah. Krabby was caught. Hey. I thought I already had a Krabby. Oh no, I missed catching a Krabby, didn't I? Because the app crashed when I was trying to catch a Krabby once before at home. CP53, only 14 HP. Minus 15, 15. I guess we'll keep him around because he's our first one at all, but not terribly happy with that Krabby. He's a bit weak. But, uh, come on, GPS. Please recognize the fact that I'm walking and make my avatar walk. There you go. It's pretty <laughs> weird talking to uh oh, ooh, another Electabuzz. Ooh. Get rid of him. Hey, that one looks like he's standing on the fence. Duck down, duck up. Woo. Nailed it. Not too bad. Come on, come on, come on. Hey! Doing alright with the catches today. The Zubats around my home have gotten a bit cheeky. There's lots of Zubats around my home, but they've started to break out of the Pokeballs fairly regularly. Kind of annoying. Or we'll dive out of the way and stuff as well. Uh, CP82, 22 HP, low kick, Thunderbolt, low kick, yay. That's a better Thunder, uh, a better uh, moveset. There we go. And Pokestop, what's this one? The Granite Monolith. Where is that thing? Oh, there it is, over there. We'll go over there so you can see it in the GoPro. Do, 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 do. Because of course all these poker stops are uh, based around sort of monuments and, and bits and pieces and uh, I've seen a few that are, that are located around bits of graffiti. Let's give it a spin see what we get. Four Pokeballs, not too shabby. Right, got another poker stop to go, and another gym. Hopefully it's a weak gym, so we can have a chance of figuring out what the hell I'm doing. <sighs> I have to remember to look around from time to time. Although, I know what this area looks like. I've walked through here probably thousands of times over the last five years or so I've lived in Sydney. But uh, for those of you who don't live in Sydney, Harbour oh, Bridge is over that way. So is the Opera House. What we get? Oh, that was just the poker stop fading out of the way. We might should be in range of the other one pretty soon. And I'm going to try and guess what it's like. It's probably like it on the little food van down there. Oh, but first, Goldine. Hello, Goldine. Are you enjoying floating above the dirt? 
Oh, I have to wait for the green ring. I keep forgetting. You're being cheeky. Oh, come on. Lame. Hey. Go ding, go ding, go ding. Hey. Hey. Come on. What do we got? CP146, not too bad. 31 HP, not too bad. Aquatel and Mud Shot. Acceptable, Goldie. Oh yeah, the uh, focus stop. Is it the food van? No, it's not. It's the sign. Why would you pick? There's a, there's a little food van down here that's, that's just part of the part of the scenery. So, well, not really a van because it's cemented into the ground. But instead of the van, they've chosen these signs, which uh, I guess is marking the Yorong precinct. Uh, three pickables. That's not very acceptable. Just three Pokeballs from Poke Stop this week. Alright. What else we got? Another Goldeen? Yeah, we're getting a few encounters now. That's good. Come on. Tap, tap, tap. Goldeen, please. Tap. There you go. Alright. Hey! I'm going to do that with the other hand, because my other hand's probably covering up the GoPro when I flick the thing, don't I? I'll go down this way. Another nice little Goldeen catch. I wish it was... I wish it was trading. I wish it was wonder trading in this game. I love wonder trading from... Or us. Uh, oh, there's the, the food thing I was talking about. CP40, 16 of 16. Mudshot horn attack. You know what? I'll just squirt this one straight across to the professor, I think. Not that impressive. Oh, oh, my eggs hatching! I forgot, it. I've got three eggs incubating. They should all be hatching right about now, actually. I think they all had uh, two kilometer eggs. Here we go, what do we get? My first egg hatch! Hmm, all right. Already had a couple of years, but whatevs. Are you strong? You're fairly strong, 26 HP. Uh, yep, there we go, there's the other egg. Like I said, incubated them all at once. Do that. Really? Come on. Transfer, please. Thank you. And. Hey! Level 7. Nice. Yeah, Poshable, Poet po Incense. Oh, we've got some incense. We'll use that later. Uh, congratulations, you in the middle. Caught 50 flying type Pokemon. Oh, I guess the uh, Pidget was, was helpful for that. What have we got in the local area, by the way? Goldings, Krabbies, Stoyas. Nothing I don't have. But here's the next gym. So let's pop in here and see what this is about. Ooh! CP210, oh, 201, do do it. Yeah, this is the same guy, isn't it? Yeah, I think these are the same guys. I'm not going to take this gym on. This gym is way too high level for me right now. Hopefully this yellow gym down here is a bit weaker. Let's find out. Are we near enough to take it on? Nope. Oh, jeez, that's even higher. <laughs> I guess the red team couldn't take this guy. Um, there's only one Pokemon at it, though. But I don't think I can take out that dude. <laughs> <laughs> with my team at the moment. I got a lot of work to do to level myself up. A lot of work to do. I guess we'll just keep wandering around to the gardens. <laughs> we saw a real bird hopping around on the ground. <sighs> we hear it. I hate leaf blowers. All the, the garden gardeners for the Robert Dogo Gardens in this local area use leaf blowers. I mean, yes, it's efficient. Jesus, noisy! It just shatters the beautiful, silent mornings. So walking through here. Anyway, I'll show you the Harbour Bridge and the uh, Opera House. Is what I'm looking for. Ooh, but first, get my electabuzz. There we go. There you go. You can see the bridge in the background. I think I might take a picture of that. Yeah. A little snapshot. Yes, I know, but you're weary. Oh, curveball. Oh, that's the thing I can trade. Did you know, by the way? I told a few people about this, I had no idea. Pick up the ball, give it a swirl till it sparkles, you can actually throw a curveball. Whoop! Bitch! <laughs> Try that again, shall we? Whoop! Curveball! And you actually get more XP for that if you do it right, apparently. Oh! Little bagger. Whoop! Oh, too much curve on that one. 
Let's go like this. Zoop. Nope, too much curve on that one. I'm trying to be. I'm trying to show you the curveball, and it's just I'm screwing it up. That'll do. Come on, stay, stay. Well, let's go. This guy's stubborn. I'm gonna stop trying to do the curveball. We're wasting too many pokeballs on this guy. Oh, what the hell? That hit his feet. It did nothing. I literally. Okay, that punched him. There we go. Stay in your ball. There's no B button to tap. Stay in your ball. Stay in your ball. Stay in your ball. Hey! Not sure how many balls that cost me, but I hope it's worth it. We've got 30 HP. Okay. And Thunder Shock. And Thunder. Eh. Eh. Alright. On we go. Really happy this catch system actually works properly. <laughs> Otherwise, all of this footage, well, 17 minutes so far, is going to be completely useless. I'm not sure even whether I'll put it up unedited or not, but. It's a Harbour Bridge, classic Sydney landmark. Also the uh, Opera House, whose name I keep forgetting for some reason. Every time I go to say Opera House, my brain just goes. I don't know what that's about. Take the stairs. We'll go down along the foreshore. Maybe we'll get some uh, magic up if we're closer to the water. <sighs> I wonder what people are thinking of me walking around here with a GoPro strapped to my phone and wires and HDMI cables coming off the bottom of it. Another electro buzzer out there. Yeah. <laughs> it looks giant. False perspective happening right there. Let's take a picture of that. Uh, if I do it like so. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's a keeper. Come on, jump for me again. I want to see if I can get a better jump. Yeah, this looks like he's standing in midair. Uh, let's try and catch him. Great throw. Is it enough? Is it enough? If you ever notice that contracting circle, different colours. Green is an easy catch. Orange is a more difficult catch. Apparently the red ones, which I haven't seen yet, are the most difficult catches. I suspect I won't see the red ones until I level up a bit. So we've got the great throw bonus of 50 XP there. I've got 100 off that before. So let's have a look at him. Oh, there we go, 366. There's my, uh, I think that's my strongest wild catch to date. So we'll uh, definitely use this guy for leveling up. In fact, we're going to power him up right now. Looks like he's close to maxing out anyway. That little arch above him, that's, that's uh, sort of how close he is to max power. Or, I forget, I'll have to shield. I'm not, sure how, I'm not sure how much wind noise there will be, because I'm not using a proper mic, because that didn't work before. Okay, we've got plenty of Stardust left, we've got plenty of Electabuzz candy. Let's go again. Okay, one more should do it. Come on, come on. Nope. Uh, what am I out of? Can't power him up anymore? Why? My level is too low to power up. Alright, so we've maxed him out. Alright, if we come across any more strong gyms, at least we'll have half a chance now, I suppose. Let's go down another electric buzz around there. What's that? Ooh! Eevee! 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 My personal favourites. Eevee. Thank you, darling. Yeah, give me a leap. Leap for me. Let's get down to the ground here so we can get a good shot again. Here we go. You're looking all cute. I wonder if I can... I can't lock exposure or anything in this mode, can I? If I do this, it might help. Damn it. I thought it was going to be. Trying to get a good shot. That's what happened here. Yeah. Come around this way. Right. Now, tricky part, trying to catch a silver. 
Nailed it first try. Hey. Oh, I got an EV. Right, what sort of level are we talking about here? We are. Do -do 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 -do. C-134, not too bad. Uh, CP is combat power, I think it stands for, by the way, in case you're curious about that. What has he got here? Swift and tackle. Not a particularly impressive even, even on this. And he's an EV, so he gets a, he gets a star from it, because he's awesome. Uh, what else we got here? Is it a Spiro? Sure is. Zero. Got a few of those already, let's just see if we can quickly catch him. Some spirit candy, so we always catch all the ones of that one again. Mm, HP, we can take a relays. Pretty average. What's that other uh, device? There he is. That's a good shot, too. I wish it was a sunny day. It's tough to get good exposure on <laughs> overcast morning like this. And on we go. CP262. Thunderbolt, Thundershock, not too bad. Here we go. Ooh, who's that? There's a gold bean in the water over there. I think we'll skip that for now. Right, so, what about this gym? The lower Botanical Gardens. The Pokestop is too far. I didn't click on the Pokestop, I clicked on the gym. Crying out loud. There we go. Uh, CP512, hmm, it's the only Pokemon he's got, and Jim is level 2, so all I can do is really lower the prestige a bit. I'll skip this for now, I think. Although, no, wait, 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 that's uh, Blue Team Jim, that's my Jim. So what I can do is leave one of my Pokemon behind. Uh, let's leave the big Electabuzz behind, see how well we can... Actually, there's already Electabuzz there, isn't there? What else we got? What else we can leave? Nothing really high level that's going to be terribly useful. Let's we'll see how we go. Um, geez, I don't know. I don't know. I've got nothing really con to contribute, do I? 5, 12, yeah. Okay, we'll skip it for now. I really can't make a decent contribution to that gym, I don't think. Although, if someone's nearly wiped out by the Electabuzz, I guess... Mine can help wipe him out, so we'll leave my second best Electabuzz. Uh, it won't be returned to your collection until it's kicked out of the gym. Let's give it a go. Hey, make the cute noise. Ooh, 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 hello. Don't have one of you yet. Zoop. There we go. The Zubats of the Sea. The old tentacle. Tentacle, tentacle. Tentacle. That was the What do we got? There it goes, God. Bridge the Pokedex. Yes, 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 yes. I know, I know. Alright, 26 HP of a CP116. Bubble Beam and Bubble Beam. Well, both water type attacks, but yeah. Oh, Krabby. Man, got a lot. Got a lot of wild encounters around this place. Come on, Krabby. Come on, Krabby. Hey! Easy. Easy peasy. Ba -do -ba -do, do -do -do -do. Okay. CP10 Krabby. Okay, we can squirt that guy away straight away, I think. Yeah. Alright, there we go. Right, uh, turn on the auto rotating map. There we go. Oh, that's a bit janky, isn't it? Chug, 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 chug. Given that frame rate, I would <laughs> I would guess the auto rotating map is probably a little bit harsher on the battery. Looks like it's making the phone do a lot of extra work. Maybe that's just a programming glitch. Either way, I 
think I'll stick to manual the map. What have we got there, little Goldine? Alright. Come on. Tap, tap, tap. Excuse me, Goldine. Tap. There we go. You guys have that problem? Sometimes the Pokemon doesn't want to... Where the hell is it? <laughs> Where the hell is the Goldine? Okay. So that's weird. It's telling me it's over this way. I don't see it anywhere. Uh, how about we turn AR off and see it? Nope, it's genuinely just not rendered in. There's a glitch I haven't seen before, but I'm not terribly surprised by. It's a very glitchy game after all. My headphones keep falling out. Um, I guess we'll try and catch the invisible Pokemon. Big surprise, my first throw missed. On the invisible Pokemon. It's very close, it's very close to us. There we go. I wonder if that's the equivalent of Pokemon's Go Shiny Pokemon. Just be invisible. I think I've crashed my game. That's what's happened there. Mm -hmm. Let's go for a walk and see if this actually... You know what I reckon's happened? The servers have crashed again. That's what's happened there. Servers have died. It's happened before. Usually, when the servers die in the middle of a catch, it's just after the Pokeball closes and the screen just freezes there with a little spinning Pokeball logo. Just on a closed Pokeball, unable to register the catch. But this one, Pokeball wide open. So, this may be the end of the video. I was hoping to take you through the actual gardens. We got horribly distracted before we even got to the gardens. And if the servers don't come back up, well, I'm just going to sit around here for an hour waiting for them to get fixed again. So, at uh, 28 minutes of adventuring, a couple of failed gyms, <laughs> I'll, uh, I'll do a sign off here. And maybe keep going in the second video, or a second part of this video, or just edit this. I don't know. Anyway, let me know what you think about my little. Uh, experiment doing uh, I was going to say live vlogging Pokemon Go but it's not really live but mobile vlogging let's playing Pokemon Go I don't know I might be the only person who's ever tried to do this so far so who knows but in any case thank you for watching I am Bloody and I will catch you next time